Hi, I'm Sean, and welcome to another episode of Coral Island. So, first thing, um, I've been checking out the recordings I do, and um, the volume for this game, even though I have it maxed out, the music is so low in the videos, and if I edit it and try to turn it up, it gets too loud. So I, I have to figure out how to fix this, because everything's maxed on audio, but it just it does not sound max. At least on my end. Maybe my speakers are just set up wrong. I don't know. Anyways, spoils of the land. How are you all? Ready for your next tips and bits on living off the land? You can find shiitake mushrooms in the forest. And obviously... Okay, I think this... Yeah, this is a rerun. Welcome to WBC, your main weather-related news source. The forecast covers Coral Island and the surrounding areas. Tomorrow's forecast is sunny and clear. Wear sunscreen. Telenovela? Duplication. Mom, what is it? What, can't a lady check up on her daughter? You can, but I'm in a rush for my next audition. Funnily enough, that's what I wanted to talk to you about. But how could you do this to me? I... Cut, thank you for your time. We'll contact you if you get the part. Ugh, how did you think it went? Am I really that bad of an actor, Tasha? Is, this, is it how I look? Is it my vibe? Is it... Oh, I gotta go with Tosh, the customer. Good evening, sir. Welcome to Watering Hole. How may I serve you? Funny you should ask that. I have a proposition for you. Oh, sir, I'm afraid we're not that kind of establishment. I'm perfectly aware. I've done my research on you. I'm here to offer a job, an acting job. If you're interested, come to this address tomorrow at 8 p.m. sharp. If you're late for even one second, consider the offer revoked. Yes, sir, I'll be there. To be continued. Uh, bring a friend with you. That's pretty dangerous. Oh, are you going to tell me about the ores and stuff? Hello, hello. What could be better than a visit from your local blacksmith? Word around town is that you've started to mine the earth shaft. It's actually why I'm here. As you mine, you'll come across ores. What good does that do me, you might be thinking? Well, you can turn ores into bars. With enough bars, our shop can upgrade your tools. Work smarter, not harder, as I like to say. For a fee, of course. To make bars, you'll need a furnace, which you can now craft, courtesy of this blueprint. You need five of the same ores to make one bar. You also need one charcoal to fire up the furnace. Yep, I think you're all set now. Yeah, and coal is so freaking hard to get. It's kind of ridiculous. Alright, craft a furnace. Oh, mastery? Ooh, in combat. Nice. I can't believe I already leveled up in combat. Um, This one. Always get the loose ba loot-based stuff. Alright, let's see. Craft a furnace. Smelt a bronze bar in your new furnace. So we need to grab a piece of coal and five of these. And there we go. Alright, we got some uh, crops. Oh yeah, I can harvest these with a scythe. Never harvest with your hands. It seems like it's a uh, Seems like it takes way longer to do. Alright, water and water. Alright, it's about time to almost buy some more crops. I think I will today. We're going to be selling these. Alright. Let's put this in there. Auto sort is not auto sorting. Yeah, auto sort is not auto sorting. Huh. Is there no way to. How do you sort the chests? Oh, right here. Why is it not putting the sword up there with the other tools? That's kind of weird. Alright, well, what's our quest right now? Defeat 30 enemies. Alright, um, I want to go get some more crops before we do anything else. Actually, I don't want to actually grow crops today. We'll, we'll wait until the next set is done. Um, I think, actually, I want to see if there's a quest on the notice board. Oh, okay, this. Hey there, Sean. It's good to see you. I'm just heading to Raja's Cafe. Or, or coffee. Are you here to socialize? Yes, by the way, what's with, pu with the pufferfish scene? No, can you tell me about Karen? Yes and no. Who is pufferfish? Uh, the oil drilling company. Ah, 
It's easier if I show you. Let's head to the community center and chat there. My coffee can wait. Well, to be fair, I don't... Are they even open? It's only 7 in the morning. Rank F. See that large F on the town rank board? Yes, that's us. It didn't happen suddenly, though. This room used to be the pride and joy of our town, proudly displaying Starlet Town's A rank. An A, Sean. Sometimes we got a B, but it was never an F. Until... Uh, I need to sit down to tell you what happened. Some time ago... That's correct, Mayor. As usual, every season we start by looking at why people visit Starlet Town. Visitors come here to see your museum, heritage sites, the ocean. The Town Rank Award is based on the condition of these attractions at this time of review. Today we're awarding Starlet Town with a rank of... I mean, you can already see it set on there, but... F. Say what? He just so, so happens to be there. Hello. Listen, prepare all nece necessary documents and equipment. I found the perfect location. Last year, an oil spill from a neighboring island made its way here and wreaked havoc. Everything went downhill from there. Karen was there at the town rink here, and they've been watching us the whole time. Those conniving pufferfish people. You heard what she said the other day at the new pufferfish building. Their plan to rescue us out of is to rebrand Star Town as an oil town. Just the thought of abandoning our legacy, the museum, ocean, and heritage sites, it's hard to accept. On the other hand, thinking about our town going under is harder. Our town used to be good, Sean. Great, even. Business was booming. The town, it was lively. I'm afraid that unless we can increase the town rank back to A and regain the trust of visitors, we'll have no choice but to work with Pufferfish. Refilling the museum seems straightforward and achievable. It'll just take time. The hill and the sick heritage sites, to, or getting rid of those stubborn roots in the ocean. Where do we even start? How do we even start? Yeah, especially the um, roots. Like, what, what kind of thing is that? The oil roots? That's weird. That's, uh, I don't think that's natural. Is it? I mean, I'm joking there, but, like, is it? Our town is in a difficult position. It's a lot to take in, I know. How about you join me for coffee? The walk in fresh air will do us both good. Is everything alright? I swear I just saw that rock glowing, Mayor. Alright, awesome. The town rank. Showcase, showcases your overall progress in revitalizing the town. Raise the town's rank by improving the ocean, the museum, and heritage. Alright, let's go see if there's any notice board quest. And there's a kitty. I don't have my, um... I don't have my bug net. Ooh, notice board request. Oh, I got some cauliflower growing. I don't know if it'll be ready in two days. Uh, tomorrow is two people's birthday. I haven't met one of them. Uh, the cauliflower might not happen. It just depends on when those grow. Let's go this way and grab the trash can. And there's no loot over here. Alright, well, I'll meet you guys over at the mines. Give me a sec. Yes, I remembered to water those. I cannot believe I forgot. Alright, I won't be needing the watering can. I'll need the sword. And I'll need these. Alright. Oh, and there's this. Um, I'll keep that up. Okay, I guess I don't get no reward for that one. Uh, that will go in there for now, until I build more chests. We'll eventually do that. I still want to clean up more of the farm. Alright, well, I was going to meet you guys at the mines, but I guess you could just walk with me. I still
still want to make progress while trying to kill 30 monsters, obviously, but I don't know if I'll be able to do both. Because, uh, yeah, I'm running out of food, and once you run out of food, you, you pretty much gotta leave, considering, you know, stamina runs down pretty quick in this game. Alright, here we are. I believe we made it to 25 last time. 15. I was I wasn't even close. <laughs> but hey, at least the exit's right there. I forgot the pickaxe, didn't I? Alright, like I said, I'll meet you guys at the mines, right? Totally uh didn't forget that. Oh, it's my first time in here. Level 15, yeah, that, that's the that's the level we're on. Alright. Alright, here's our town ranking thing. There's 134, really? There's only 134 items to donate? Wait, what? Oh no, that's probably how much points I have until the next rank of the museum. That's probably what that is. Alright, there is a bunch of ores over there. And I gotta kill monsters. Ooh, more goop. Nice. Alright, let's gather all this. God, that ring is so amazing. Alright, let's go down. Let's at least try to get to 20. Maybe we'll get lucky. Oh, okay. Can't fit through here somehow. Aww, those should definitely drop coal since it has coal in the image. I'd make it like an empty texture if they're empty. That'd be great. Oh, there's our hole. Nice. Alright, well. I'll break these. Oh, there's our exit, but I'm gonna kill the monsters. God, the ring making the sword faster is just overpowered. Next floor. More ores, that's always nice. Awesome. There's a monster over there, so we will go and kill it first. Here, we'll go ahead and do this. We've killed 11 so far. Still got a ways to go. Some tools hanging there. Alright, another monster. And you can't go through those doors, sadly. Alright, any exit over here? Yeah, see, you can't go through the doors. That's for the torch. You can turn the torches off. I don't know why you'd want to do that, but you can do it. Got some earth juice from a rock. Oh, no. Alright, still no exit. Some more earth juice. Nice. There we go. Awesome. Ooh. That was not what was in that. There was something yellow in that. But that's something we can donate to the museum, I believe. go all right we'll be on floor 20 soon all right no exit over there some coal that's always nice the exit please 
Ooh, more earth juice. Ooh, even more earth juice. Nice. I don't know what those are for, but I'll take them. Ooh, a geode. More coal. Oh, I'm getting lucky. That means something bad's gonna happen. All right, I gotta break the big rocks. Um, I'll be, I'll be back. Found it. Nice. Let's go down. I wonder if you could fish here. Golden crusted hammer. Is that a weapon? 160 damage? Oh, hell yeah, I'll take the hammer. So it swings pretty fast, but I wonder. Yeah, this ring uh, helps out quite a bit. All right, let's uh, keep going. We st we only reached 16 enemies. Easy peasy. Ouch. All right, I'm gonna have to eat something soon. Is there no special with the hammer? That's kind of sad. At least I'm not getting one unless you have to unlock it. That would kind of make sense. Maybe. All right, give me that exit, please. Earth juice. Lovely. All right, I'll be back. The first one I hit after I unpause or I pause and I get it. Also, 10 more monsters. We'll try to make it as far as possible before uh, we end it. We don't have a time limit on this quest, so. Nice. What? Why, why is it hitting that one? I was hitting this one originally. Why did it switch? That's so weird. I don't know why it did that. Some compost. Nothing like some poop in a box, right? Well, it's not really poop poop, but you, you get what I mean. Alright, break these. Alright, well, let's look for the exit. Uh, let's eat, though. I forgot. I should have brought the goop thing. The ball of goop I had. All right, what about you? Nope. Okay. A couple more. And then we'll skip. So when I get it. All right. This time it was the second one I broke. All right. Easy peasy. Ooh, give me bone. And it's just exit finding time now. Because there's nothing else on this level. I wonder if you have a bomb or something, if you could break these. That'd be kind of interesting. All right, game. Give me. Also, um, oh, there it goes. It disappeared for a second again. There's one more small one. I'll be back. Found it. Also, remember how my, uh, thing disappeared? It goes under the ground. That's why it disappears, because some areas, it can't go above. What? Why? It's just an outline on a box. It shouldn't be part of the game world like that. That's weird. <laughs> I've never ever seen something like that. What the? Oh, you're a monster. Are you underground? How? How do you hit this thing? How, how do you hit this thing? You can't hit it. Okay, that's 
weird. I've used the pickaxe, the hoe. I, I don't get how to attack that thing. It's... I see. I see what's wrong. So, you might notice, uh, is my thing disappearing? No, it's not. But it's underground. I can't hit it because it's underground. There it goes. What the hell was that all about? That's so weird, man. Alright. That was weird. It wouldn't let me move. 320 damage. My god. I wonder what other kind of weapons there are. The hammer's cool because of the ring. I think if I didn't have this ring, I probably wouldn't be using this hammer. It's pretty slow. But uh, it's time to look for the exit. Everyone's favorite game. Come on. Give me the exit. Alright, I'll be back. Holy crap, I had to eat quite a bit of these and I broke a ton of the big rocks and I finally got it. I checked the time, it was like 7.10 and then all of a sudden it's 8.50. Or 7 something, but yeah, oh my god. Also, finally, 30 freaking enemies. Can't believe I didn't get it in uh, 10 levels. Kill, I'll kill them still all because I want their loot and plus you got to get your combat up these things are these things are tanks all right I'm just gonna go I don't really want to waste candy for a couple extra ores let's just get out of here I'll meet you guys back at home. Uh, this kind of sucks that my screen's all gray. I don't know why it would activate the cutscene at night when it's 9 p.m. So the color's going to be a little weird here. Sean, we've been expecting you. You did good defeating those monsters. Come, let's start your initiation into the guild. And that's why you never bet against Kira. Foolish, Mark. All right, all right. I'll leave your coins here, Kira. Wasn't expecting Garden Rake here to pull it off. Still, you sure about this, Kira? Garden Rake got through more monsters than you did in your first month, Mark, so zip it. Then why was my test 30 if his test was lower and for a month? What? <laughs> Any objections before we start? Another Greenhorn. I haven't even acknowledged this Mark boy. And what's this? You got a farmer doing an adventures? Oh, hmm. Do what you want, Kira. It's your branch. Thank you, Geodan. I, or Geodon. I don't know how to pronounce that. Sorry. I appreciate it. Mark, bring me the sword. Thank you, big boy. Are you ready, Sean? Sean, do you wish to become a member of this guild? We only have three rules you must uphold. First, defend humanity from the evils of this world. Second, help those in need if it fits your capacity to do so. And last, have a smile on your face as you adventure. Knowing the three rules, do you pledge your allegiance to the Band of Smiles? Then I welcome you to the Band of Smiles. You're now one of us. Didn't even let me say yes or no. I don't want to join the band of smiles. I want to join the band of frowns. Because I'm frowning right now that the color is all messed up because I'm dying. Fresh meat. The best kind of meat. One day we shall spar, you and I. Preferably at a different chapter, though. Perhaps where Sanja, Sinja and I are from. It's decided you'll visit us sometime. Oi, enough chit-chat. The sword. Put it back above the fireplace. It's a decoration. The Brotherhood of Steel Badge! Yay! 
Wow. That's what it reminds me of when I first saw it in Early Access 2. It was like the BOS badge, the Brotherhood of Steel. More quests. What's this? You can complete errands for BOS here. Ooh, you're you're open? Explosives? 50? Are, are, are you serious? <laughs> can these stack? Chance to come across gold. It's a weapon. I can see that. Sus. Are you freaking kidding me? Sus spear. Sus sword. Sus hammer. Okay. Can these stack? Can you imagine? Um, I'm not gonna buy anything though. Um, this is not disappearing. Okay. Seven bronze ore. Yes. Hell yeah, first quest done. It's still not disappearing. But that's cool. Um, it kind of sucks my screen's all messed up from the uh, color. Um, I'm pretty sure you can turn that off in the settings. Let's see. Disable. Yeah, okay, su sweet. I remember in early access that... That, by the way, did not work. You could not turn it off. It stayed no matter what. So, also there is a lightning bug. Those are nighttime uh, things that appear. I don't need the wood from there. And wild seeds are cool, but I'd rather have these two things. Cavern. There's a cavern that way, too? Huh, I wonder if that's any new kind of mines or anything. All right, well, let's go ahead and deposit our stuff. I could break one of these rocks to get move out of the way, but it's pretty easy to pass through here. Sometimes it seems like it lets you go into areas that are really small, and then sometimes it's just like, nah. Okay. Oh, that's the wrong chest. There we go. You can go in there for now. Alright, so f ores, huh? Um, I had... Where's my ores? Where did I put them? Oh, they're in here. Alright, five of them. Alright, well, let's go to bed. Hopefully I have cauliflower tomorrow. I did up the time, by the way. I made it to where it's at 70%, I believe. Also, mining level 2. Awesome. And a little bit of money. Not a lot. I think it was like 6. Oh, it's this. You hear a voice, but you can't make out what's being said. Sean. Try to focus on my voice. Good, now listen closely. The sacred trees, please visit any of them. Find them around the island. And flashbang. Touch the tablet to summon them. They will open your eye. You are my hope to heal this island. Now wake up and go, Sean. You are the chosen one. Alright. You had a strange dream last night. I sure did. Back to nature with Jenna. You can find... Okay, it's a rerun again. Sunny, a hat may be advisable for those who live near the beach. Good day, everyone. Welcome to the Coral Talk Show. Here you get to see guests all across the world, our worlds, or worlds, and 
wait, across the world or worlds and sneak a peek through their lives. I, Connie, will be your host, and today we will welcome a very special guest, Helen from Midgar, who works for a terror, um, sorry, activist group called Landslide. Easy recognizable by his humongous sword and dour expression, please welcome, oh my god, Claude Strafe. Hello. Alright, alright, alright. Claude, so what's the deal with terror uh, activities that you and Landslide have been doing lately? Honestly, I don't care. I'm just here to do my job and get paid. Ooh, a candid answer. I love it. That's exactly what I say to people when they ask why I did this show. Right. Moving on, an audience wants to know about this. How much gel did you use for your hair? My hair? No, I don't. Ah, toupee then. Is it a body problem? No, it's just... All right, that's all the time we got for today, folks. Next week, we'll meet a new, exciting, mysterious guest. Until then, take care. Wait, about my hair. <laughs> Cloud Stroff. Claude Stroff. Or Strafe, whatever. Ooh, we... Oh, yep. I. What did I say? What did I say? No. No. Doing this without the scythe. Okay, something tells me those aren't going to be ready. More bars. Alright. Let's water the crops real quick. And I don't need to go to the mines. So let's do something else today. Like fishing and bug catching. What? Oh. And these can be put up. And the watering can. Alright. forget what these are, but we'll water them. Um, I will buy some more crops. We need to. And this is the cauliflower. Um, I don't know if it's going to be done tomorrow, which is the last day for that quest, so... I'm pretty sure it is, at least. Deadline is tomorrow. Yep. Alright. Put you up. Sprout... I'm glad to hear rumors about a new farm in Starlet Town it is true. You've been doing excellent work in the fields. Give this fertilizer a try. Apply it to the soil. It'll increase your chances of harvesting higher quality crops, which will fetch more coins. Alright, we need nine from there. Alright, let's go and explore. Let's do some early morning fishing. There we go. And we can still see. It's perfect. I still haven't made my list for fish and bugs. But I'm not really in a hurry. We can go through a couple years or so. We're technically going to keep going until I beat the whole story. However long that is. I definitely... I think you have to finish the museum and stuff for the story anyways. Hey, a crayfish. Let's do another fish. Need a couple of those. So we can donate one and keep one, just in case. There it is. It's definitely an easy fish. Oh, it's one of those. I definitely don't need those. Alright, let's fish again. I will fish in the mines eventually. We'll get to it eventually. Oh, there it is. It's trash. Quite literally, too. Also, it seems stamina is depending on what you fish up, because I only lost one piece of stamina there. Doo -doo -doo -doo. I really hope the music gets better, um, like longer, or not longer, but, um, ooh, brown trout. I mean, like, um, better in, like, louder, pretty much, is what I mean by that. It's closed, okay. Of course, the newcomer is a distasteful and damaging oil drilling company. This is why you don't trust outsiders. It's no use wasting your energy on being angry at Pufferfish Corp. 
It's better to redirect that energy into something more productive. I want to say I'm surprised Pufferfish moved in, but I'm not. Life is unfair sometimes. I can agree with that. Alright. Some trash. Nice. Oh no, the empty building in front of my uncle's house is all clean now. I can't play there with my friends anymore. What's Pufferfish? Oh, the new office across school? Yeah, okay. Grab that. Alright. Let's go to the store. It's nine now. All right. What? 12 p.m. Excuse me? Why even let me go in there? Well, that sucks. All right, sorry for the pause. Let's try to get you. Nice, a pine sphinx. It's perfectly camouflaged among grass and leaves. Uh, the color's a little off from the grass, so it doesn't look like it would camouflage that well. I know we're supposed to go to the trees. Uh, we will head there eventually. What, what's bad about getting more money, even if it's from an oil company? Besides, this town can be a little less boring, too, with their promises. I should check up on Betty. Gotta make sure she's alright. She was, like, so upset at Pufferfish meeting. I've seen her... I've never seen her so worked up like that. Alright, anything over here to grab? I guess we could fish over here, right? Do a little bit of fishing. Don't know how good the fish are gonna... Nope. Oh, okay, that was weird. Don't know how the f good the fish are gonna be with this right here, but... Oil tentacles. This is so weird. Roots. They call them roots in the game, don't they? Oil roots. I'll get this one. It's gonna be hard, but I'll get I'll get it. My finger itches no. A barracuda, a predatory saltwater fish. Holy crap, okay. That's nice. Grab <laughs> it just waved and dug in the ground. Alright, anything over here? Ooh, we got this. It's almost 12, so we can start almost heading back. I do want to forage a little bit more. A fly. That's, uh... My guy opens someone's trash can and just pulls out a fly. Wow. Some loot over here. Just chilling under the tree. I'm not sure where to stand on this puffer fish thing. Anyway, I hope they pay good tips when they're getting some coffee. So it's an oil company, huh? I don't think tourists are going to book our inn again with oil drills around here. Yeah, that would kind of be distracting, wouldn't it? Get some trash. Alright, we'll deposit this stuff because I'm pretty sure I'm almost out of inventory room. Oh, I have four more. And a mastery for mining. Um. Yeen. I don't know. Let's do this. Might as well get that uh, extra geo chance for the museum. I wonder if you can respect anything, if you can uh, set, reset your points and stuff. They usually call it respect, right? Alright, well. Donated one of those. I could donate that. 
I can donate that. Uh, where'd the fish go? Alright, let's go donate these real quick. And then we'll head to the store and buy some stuff. Barracuda. Crayfish. It looks like a tiny lobster and lives in fresh water. Used to catch fish. This one's good for beginners. Oh. Hmm? Yeah? Ah, the new resident. Man, Antonio. I think it, that's whose birthday it is today. I don't really have anything good to give people for... Oh, I should have brought that gemstone I found. But yeah, I don't think I have much good to give anyone right now. 20 glass. Okay, cool. We can also go by the Band of Smiles to see if they have anything for sale. Or not sale, but um, quests or whatever. Alright, you're open. Uh, shop. You now sell- why is this showing new? I thought you I already seen you sell bread, that's weird. Alright. Um, I wonder which one sells the most. These take 10 days. Cauliflower probably sells the most, but it takes 10. 10 day- oh, we're not having that cauliflower at all in time. I hate when they give you quests that do that. All right, so, um, oh, I can get, I can make these and I can go. There's two people who have a birthday today. Um, what was it? Town rank journal. Oh God. Produce does not tell you how much it sells for that kind of sucks I was kind of hoping it did oh that sucks all right well whatever um carrots are only seven days potatoes are five cauliflower takes ten they probably give you the most money but I can afford a bunch of potatoes what I'm gonna do though is I'm gonna get nine we're gonna get nine of each thing uh, carrots there we go and there goes most of my money. Alright, let's see whose birthday it is today so we can give some flowers to him. Um, today is Paul and Antonio. Well, I know where Antonio is. Never mind, I, I knew- oh yeah, Antonio's over there. Uh, Paul is... You can just go to this. Find Paul. And find NPC. Paul is at the beach. Okay. Easy peasy to find them. Let's give some birthday gifts. I'll try to give flowers as gifts each time someone has a birthday just to give them something. Ah, birthday gift. Thank you. You're very kind. Ooh. Pine Finks. A copper quality. Don't know why it has to show me the card again for higher quality ones. It's a tad weird. Maybe if it give you like new information, the higher qualities you get. That'd be kind of cool. Alright, is this Paul? Uh, I can't even give him a gift. You can't just accept the gift. Oh, I don't know how long they're going to be at this. Well, that sucks. Okay, I guess I'll fish for a bit. Oh, I wish I could still see up there. Oh, well. It's not that big of a deal. Ooh, this is a 
thick looking fish. It is spasming the hell out. All right. Ooh, that was close. God. I get it so close and then it just gets all the way back down. Oh, that was a lobster? Lobster was that hard to catch? Holy crap. All right, they can't be playing that all day. They're, they're going to have to eventually go home, right? I like how time still passes when I'm fit. I didn't mean to do that. My mouse is too sensitive. All right, there we go. All right, pretty easy so far. You just pulled that food out of the sand, didn't you? Ruby red dragonette. All right, so lobster commonly found near the pier. Well, I'm not even near there, but okay. Small feisty fish. All right, let's catch another one. And there we go. It's just trash. Are you guys still fish or playing? Can you like hurry up, please? I want to give you this gift. I mean, I'm glad to be able to fish, but come on. All right, I'll be back. They're moving. This fish is taking forever. It's another lobster. All right, cool. You showed me the lobster. Let's go. Run, run, run. Man, Paul, you are fast. I didn't mean to talk to you. Yeah, I know. There's a serious issue. This is a special. Thank you for the birthday gift. All right, sweet. Mission accomplished. Let's go donate the fish I've caught. I also caught a blue tang. It's flat and circular. I don't think I caught anything else. Yeah, nothing else different. That guy's been reading here for like five or more hours. And they played volleyball for five or more hours. Nice. I've donated quite a bit of fish. Can't wait to unlock these. Oh man, I cannot wait. Alright, we got a bunch of crops to plant. Starlet Town, farm, and diving. Should be unlocking diving soon. It might be tomorrow, I'm not sure. Also, yeah, no cauliflower tomorrow. All right, you can go in there. Um, put those up. And put you up. Um, okay, I guess I do have to do this. I was hoping for a quick drag from the bag, but... And we're gonna need the watering can. I don't think I can do all of this, but I'll try. All right, we're going to plant the cauliflower first. All right, got to water them. All right, I might as well water these. Watering is so easy in this game. All right, next we'll put, plant the carrots. All right, next we'll plant these. All right, and you can do right here. Oh, sweet, a coffer. Bring it to a blacksmith. And it's pretty much a treasure trove. 
pretty sure they work the same. You'd pretty much just find uh, higher chances of artifacts instead of ores and stuff. Alright, there's those. Yeah, this is like perfect. Like a perfect amount of space. Except for right there, obviously. But, oh, I do have two more things left. Alright, so I'm going to do... There's nine, right? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we'll just do right here. I know it's not... It doesn't look the best, but... Oh, well, this is it for now. It's fine. It takes three to water for energy, I mean. All right, and now. Okay, game. I'm gonna be out of energy watering all these every day. Can you imagine if it took energy to place these? Alright, you can go in there. I, I'll put you in there for now. Well, now, I know I know where I'm putting you. Alright, so, uh, grab this real quick. Just to get it out of the way. Need to do some more farm cleaning. Alright. Wrong button. Can I craft another chest? Wood into coal, scrap into glass. Okay, so this is how you probably get a lot of coal. Can make another ocean explorer chest. If I want to spend all my uh, ore. But I'd rather use wooden trash for now. I mean, it's a nice chest, but that's a lot of ore to use. And I want to upgrade my pickaxe because I do have enough uh, copper bars for it. I just don't have... I don't have the right um, money also. Sell one of you. Sell one of you. You're too valuable to sell. That will give us the thing for selling those. Um, I haven't sold one of you. I haven't sold one of you. I want to sell one of everything. I know, maybe that's like stupid, but... You know, oh well. I will sell the shells for now. Alright, I've sold the shells before. Not those and not those. Alright, it'll at least show me the prices now of those. Do I have any fishing things I can sell, actually? Um, I'll, I need only one of each thing for now. Um, I'm gonna keep that just in case. Okay. Oh, I haven't donated that yet. I don't organize. Alright, so I can at least make some money off these. Alright, let's go to bed and see how much money we made. He's gonna open it and be like, what the hell is he selling in here? Small fish bait. And plus hearts, nice. And 727. 141 was from far farming. 288 from foraging. The shells are worth a lot. Fishing didn't give me anything really. Catching didn't give me anything. And other was, well, this stuff. The monster loot is not worth selling. You might as well keep that stuff because you need it for stuff, I believe. So yeah, don't sell stuff. 
like that. I just did it so I could find, you know, have them in the thing as something sold. Anyways, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye.